calves are imploding. It's your boy Plugatachi, and I'm working a late night shift. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and bell button. Let's get into it, guys. I know, I know, I know nobody wants to say it, but I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. The calves are imploding. After suffering a 148-124 loss to the Oklahoma City Thunder, the main thing that I was noticing was the body language of the players. I mean, throughout this game, we didn't see anybody hustling. We didn't see any second chance points. We didn't see anybody going for that second effort, third effort. These guys were just looking lazy. At times, the crowd was even booing. You can tell by LeBron's body language that he was fed up. And I don't know. I don't know how, it's going, how, how, how this is going to work. I mean, IT, Isaiah Thomas, is a defensive liability. Russell Westbrook had 20-plus points and 20 assists on this guy. He even knows he's a defensive ability, liability. I mean, at, at all times, you got to have somebody helping this guy out. And I just feel like the way the Cavaliers team is made up, they can't afford to have any type of defensive liabilities. They have, if not the oldest team in the league, one of the oldest teams in the league and injury riddled teams. You got the glass maker, Derrick Rose. You got the Chuck. Bucket Chucker, J.R. Smith, and you got Isaiah just getting back from injury. So, yeah, guys, I mean, I feel like this team is going to have to make a major trade, a major move. They have to do something. I think the Isaiah Thomas experiment needs to end. The J.R. Smith experiment needs to end. These guys need to get some interior defense. I mean, right now, in the last uh, 10, 10 games, they're, they're last in every major defensive, team defensive category. Last, guys. They've lost 10 of their last 13 games. And their more, mo most efficient player and consistent player outside of LeBron has been Kevin Love. So, they need to get Kevin Love some more touches. Um, Kevin Love shooting uh, 50%, uh, 40% from deep, has ha having one of his best seasons since 2011 with the Timberwolves. The man needs more touches. But I just see this team imploding. LeBron was mentioning uh, tonight how he help, hopes Lou doesn't get fired. And in all these guys, they just look like they were not interested and tired. I mean, D. Rose, he looked good coming back from his injury. He looked real explosive, but they just don't know how long Derrick Rose can last. This team is just not made to be championship contenders. They need a better rim protector. Tristan Thompson lately has been terrible, and they need some more shooters or somebody that can play outside, off the ball, off LeBron. Because Isaiah, he's more of the I need the ball, off the dribble type of player. He's not as good as a catch and shoot type like Kyrie as we're seeing. And it just doesn't seem like that that the Isaiah LeBron is a good fit. I mean, at times they had LeBron playing center, guys. I mean, I know they say LeBron can play all five positions, but come on now. The man out there playing center. Just get the guy some help. He looked extremely frustrated. His body language, nobody was getting back. Nobody was helping out on defense. No communication. We seen LeBron sitting on the bench, all isolated by himself. And you know what? You know what happens when LeBron sits on the bench, all isolated by himself, which means he's fed up with his teammates. Kevin Love went out early. He wasn't feeling well. Might have been under the weather. But I just see this team starting to implode. I mean, boss. I mean, it was was on the record he was he was talking about how he feel like they played more teamwork type of de defense in boston my man's 
Why are you still focusing on Boston? Isaiah Thomas, listen to me. Let it go, bro. Focus on the task at hand, which is your team, Cleveland, and focus on winning you a ring with Cleveland. Let Boston go. I mean, these guys got to start letting, letting this stuff go. It's a business. You play with the best player in the world right now. Focus on winning some games. Focus on not being a defensive liability. But like I said, this team is old, guys. They need they need um, some type of lift. They need a, a spark. You know what I mean? Um, I heard the rumblings that they're, they're interested in Tristan Thompson. Uh, uh, I'm not Tristan Thompson. I mean, DeAndre Jordan, um, Lou Williams. Uh, uh, and I think that's a good look. I think that if they pick up DeAndre Jordan and Lou Williams, that is a good look. Now, I don't know what they would have to give up. Um, I'm here in first round, maybe IT, Tristan, Shump. But all I know is that they need a jolt of energy. I mean, Kemba Walker would be a better replacement for Kyrie Irving than IT. I mean, the guy is just too small. You know, if, if you're not going to win a championship with Isaiah Thomas as your starting point guard, I'm just going to go ahead and say, you're not going to win a championship like that. So, I don't know. I, this this team, I just feel like this team is imploding. LeBron, he, he wants to stay. He wants to stay. He wants to be a cat for life. But y'all got to get the guy right, players. I mean, you can have all the talent in the world, but you need some guys that's going to commit to the system and the right players. And, and y'all still need a good coach. Get, get Lou up out here, man. I mean, no disrespect to Lou, but y'all, we, we need to get a better coach. You know what I'm saying? They need a better coach. Um, let me know what you think in the comments, guys. Are the Cavs imploding? Do you think that they are still contenders? Do you think that they can win out the East and get back to the championship? I don't know, guys. Y'all let me know in the comments. It's your boy, Plug Atachi, and I'm out.